working on today's video. Um, I went for like a scary spice meets baby spice look today. I don't know. Don't ask me. Anyway, that was cute though. So today I'm going to be doing my first ever reaction video. It turns out these are a lot easier to make than I thought they were. I definitely have not been giving myself enough credit these past couple of years for my level of capabilities when it comes to all this editing stuff. But anyway, so there are two videos that I will be reacting to today. They both have to do with the legend of Ganji. Um, so the first video is going to be about the creators kind of explaining the story context. And the second video that I'll be reacting to is the prologue uh, series trailer that they put out. So, uh, you know, grab your snack, strap in with me, and let's get right into the reaction. So what exactly then is The Legend of Genji? It's a fan-based volunteer project that aims to tell the story of a new avatar in a web-based comic format. We're not at all affiliated with Nickelodeon, Viacom, or okay, Ryan so and Mike. Not We're not doing this for any profit. What we want to do, through our own story, is bring the original series to new fans and to create new content for longtime fans of the old series. Our comic takes place 17 years after the death of Avatar Khan, who at age 39 sacrificed herself to protect the citizens of Bessensei yes, from a terrorist power. attack involving the detonation of a catastrophic spirit bomb. The world feared that Korra died in the Avatar state, but thankfully the Avatar cycle does continue and our protagonist, the next Earth Avatar, Genji, is born. Growing up in the isolated stretches of the Siwon Desert, Genji is unfortunately not found by the White Lotus as a child. Global unrest, panic and looming war led certain individuals to take matters into their own hands and creating their own perfect avatar. After careful plotting and deliberation, a charming boy from Gaoling is chosen. So this is gonna go well, Six year old one down. fills the void that Avatar Kara left behind and he brings hope to the heartbroken world. For the first time in history, the Avatar's growth and progress is captured on television, resulting in celebrity like news coverage and global adoration. If you're wondering you how on earth this fake Avatar plan was designed and how it could have possibly fooled millions of people, you just have to read the comic to find out. Well, that definitely has me interested. Let's pop over to the prologue series trailer that they created and let's see what else this is going to be about. <sighs> Rest in power, Korra. I told you this is not a Korra hate channel. I like her, she's just annoying. Before we conclude this vigil, I wanted Kara. to say a few words. First, thank you all for being here, for traveling so far to pay your respects. It's difficult to fathom why tragedy strikes. Why those we love and admire so are taken away from us, no. so suddenly, so unexpectedly. A few days ago, we lost someone. A woman whose compassion, resilience, and strength served as a beacon of hope and light for all. Her legacy can be seen in the eyes of the airbenders she has saved. It's felt in the hearts of the friends and family she's left behind. And it can be found in the blinding light of the spirit portals that unite our worlds. Yesterday, my father spoke about how all of life is reflected in the changing of the seasons. Life is a cycle. Change is inevitable. And it's something to be embraced, not feared. We mourn the sudden passing of Avatar Korra. But we can also celebrate the birth of a new Avatar. The future may be uncertain, but Korra's spirit lives on. I have faith that the cycle of the Avatar has begun anew. Thank goodness, I'm glad that they picked Janora to narrate. Aw, oh, she's all grown up and stuff. That looks so good. You can tell that they put a lot of effort into the story development. The art, everything looked am amazing. This looks like a professional... Network 
production. So that's pretty amazing. And I'm so excited to have new Avatar content. Like, yes, let's go. Well, thanks for snacking with me, guys. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this new story concept. Um, the Legend of Genji. I really hope I'm saying that correctly. God, Genji. Legend of Genji. Anyway, uh, I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty excited about this. It looks like it's actually going to be really good. And I can't wait for them to put out the first series, you know? Um, both of the videos are going to be linked down below in the description box. I definitely recommend you check them out. Especially that first video because I only reacted to the section that had to do specifically with story creation and the context of, uh, you know, the story that they're trying to tell. So there's a lot more information about the background of how this project came together and, you know, different story elements and their ideas about whether they want to take this series. So please go check out that first video. Like they said, they're all doing this volunteer base there is no money being made off of this project so i think that's pretty amazing that they're using their free time to give us such amazing high level quality content i'm super excited about it so if you like this video please give it a like and also subscribe if you're new here uh also if you have watched my other videos and haven't subscribed what are you doing please just go like it go like it click it. Thanks so much guys for sticking here till the end and I will see you in the next one. Bye!